friends welcome back to my youtube channel chemistry basics today we are going to see carbanion and their reactions in this we are going to see structure and formation of carbanion so let's start first what is carbanion what's its definition name itself suggests that any organic species which contains negatively charged carbon is called as carbanion negatively charged carbon should be present in that organic species let's see the structure of the carbanion so in car carbanion carbon is sp3 hybridized we know that carbon is tetravalent so here three groups i have shown here they are oriented at the corner of the regular tetrahedron and it contains a p orbital which contains a electron pair or we can say unshared electron pair so therefore it has a negative charge at the electron rich species and therefore carbanion has a tetrahedral geometry there is a some exception also if you have a uh, allylic carbanion so that will be the sp2 hybridized so remember that so usually if you have a such a type of carbanion these are sp3 hybridized now how the carbanions are formed formation of carbanion so first method by removal of an atom x from carbon so here is the compound that i have taken it's having a x that's the leaving group and when it is reacted with any nucleophilic species so this nucleophilic species attacks this leaving group and detached it from this carbon so what this leaving group will do it leaves behind its electron pair so as to this carbon gets negatively charged this is the carbanion formation this will be the side for carbon with a negative charge so this is a simple method so let's see the example carbanion from triphenyl methyl chloride so here is a triphenyl methyl chloride if you are reacting with the sodium metal so it will form this trimethyl triphenyl methyl carbanion this is carbanion this carbanion is highly stable as it is attached to three phenyl rings and this negative charge will be delocalized in the three phenyl rings through resonance stabilization and therefore these carbanions are highly stable so in this carbanion formation if you see it cl is removed and this bonding electron pair is leaves behind therefore this carbanion is formed okay similarly if you see a carbanion from triphenyl methyl triphenyl methyl so this amide ion i'll basic that will abstract this proton so as to again this bonding pair leaves behind which is going on the carbon and there is a formation of carbanion so same carbanion is formed here which will be well stabilized by resonance okay so this is about the carbanion formation by removal of x groups the type of, the type of x groups we are removing okay that we are going to see it's from alkynes and alkenes from alkynes and alkenes how we can prepare the carbanions so here i have taken some examples alkane it's a ethane alkene ethene and alkyne is ethyne now most important thing we have to see in this table so what's the hybridization of the carbon here so it is a sp3 single bond double bond sp2 and triple bond it's sp now their corresponding pka values are given here 52 37 and 25 so what is the relation between pka and acidity then it will be the weaker acid and if the pka values are lower then it will be the stronger acid so out of these three if you see a pka value for ethyne or acetylene is a lower so that means this is the stronger acid that means this hydrogen is highly acidic now why this hydrogen is highly acidic here due to the percentage of s character is higher it is a 
here is only 33 percent here is only 25 percent but here it's a 50 percent percentage of s character is so here we have written what's this as percentage of s character of ch bond increases acidic character increases and hence carbanion formation becomes easier and we have taken the reaction also if you see this is the acetylenic ch due to the higher percentage of s character of this carbon this hydrogen becomes highly acidic and it can be easily picked up by strong bases like amide ions and they will form the carbanion and ammonia will be the side product so this carbanion is synthetically very important carbanion this acetylide carbanions okay so remember here is our group it's not it it is our group okay so this carbanions can easily formed in presence of the highly basic medium there okay so remember this second method from alkynes alkynes usually not able to form easily carbon and they can form but not easily due to the lesser percentage of s character but this 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 carbanions are highly stable okay <clears throat> so let's go for the next method now third method introduction of electron withdrawing group if you are introducing electron withdrawing group in any molecule definitely it increases the acidity of ch bond let's take the example here it's a methane here it's a trifluoromethane because three phenyl uh, sorry three fluorine groups are attached to this carbon so just i'm replacing these three hydrogens by fluorine so electronegative atom and here the chlorine is now replaced by CF3 group trifluoromethyl group so what will happen here we are introducing electron withdrawing group so fluorine 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 so it withdraws the electron three fluorines they are going to be withdraws the electron so definitely what will happen this carbon becomes electrophilic electron deficient and when it becomes electron deficient, it withdraws the electron from the CH bond. So this hydrogen becomes acidic. So if it becomes acidic, it will be easily detached and this electron pair is going on carbon. So it becomes a carbanion. So to form a carbanion, we can introduce electron withdrawing group. Similarly, here also 3 plus 3 plus 3, 9 fluorine atoms. So definitely, it's high, high, high minus I effect is there. So this carbonyl is highly stable. And therefore, we can see the pK values also. They are going to be decreased as we are introducing electron withdrawing group. It's a 43. If you are introducing fluorines, it decreases to 28. If here I am... Uh, Replacing that group by a trifluoromethyl group now it's going to be 11 So highly decreased so definitely it's highly highly acidic compound. Okay, so this is the third method Similarly if you have a multiple bonds attached to the Methyl group or CH bond we can say okay see here it's a cyanide carbonyl nitro here are two nitro groups attached to the methylene group. PK values if you say 25, 20, 10.2 and 4. So PK values are going to be decreased. PK values are going to be decreased. So if you are removing the H or hydrogen from this carbon. So corresponding carbanions are formed. So see here, these carbanions are formed. And now these carbanions are well stabilized by a resonance effect as well as minus I effect. Two effects are there nitrogen electron withdrawing, oxygen electron withdrawing, NO2 electron withdrawing, NO2 electron withdrawing, everywhere minus I and minus R. Both effects are operated and therefore these carbanions are well stabilized. Here two oxygens, that nitro group, that particular negative charge is delocalized in that particular nitro group. We have two nitro groups, so highly, highly stable carbon. And therefore, if you see here, pK value is only 4. pK value is only 4 there. Okay. So remember that. So 
if you have a electron withdrawing groups in the compound carbanion formation becomes very easy so always remember that electron withdrawing group should be there for carbanion formation now let's go for the next carbanions from carbonyl compounds just we have seen that acetone here again we are going to see the same but in a different uh, stability factor okay so carbonyl compounds containing alpha hydrogen atoms can form carbanions which possesses a enolate stability enolate stability so see here this is the acetone this is the alpha carbon if you are removing this alpha hydrogen carbanion will form here and this carbanion will have a definitely it's a resonance stability but we can say it is a enolate stability also because it forms a enolate ion this is the enolate ion so alkene is attached to the negatively charged oxygen so this is the enolate ion similarly acetaldehydes also can form the same thing removal of hydrogen there is a formation of carbanion so this carbanion will be stabilized by enolate ion so in this way we can easily form the carbanions okay so this is about the carbanion formation methods so today we have seen what is carbanion its structure and carbanion formation how that carbanion formation will be if you like this video so subscribe the channel so you can press the bell icon button so you will get the notification of the next video and you can share and comment if you like this video thank you very much